Hey everybody, good evening. Well, if you are in Manila time, it's almost midnight. It's about 11.08. And if you're in other parts of the world, hello, this is Dempster, and I hope you're doing well and staying safe. Uh, just a few days ago, we learned the sad news that the original voice actor of Leon S. Kennedy in the original Resident Evil 2, Mr. Paul Adad, passed away and the RE community is still mourning over his loss. It's been reported in multiple sources and news outlets and he has been battling throat cancer and had had a neurological disorder so among other things and then we find out that he passed on April 11th and it dealt a big blow to us Resident Evil fans for us who grew up playing the original Resident Evil 2 in 1998. So as a tribute to him among other things that I've written in my page, in my blog, and even doing a picture where I put my Leon setup along with my hoodie. Here, the good old classic RPD hoodie from Resident Evil 2 in memory of Mr. Paul Haddad. So today I'll be playing some classic Resident Evil 2, specifically the demo that was included with the director's cut. Resident Evil 2 preview. So for those who haven't actually touched this, this was the demo disc, the uh, official demo disc of Resident Evil 2 that pa was packed along with uh, the director's cut when it was released in 1997. It gave us our first taste of Resident Evil 2 and Paul Haddad's voice was here. Uh, and you'll notice some differences. We'll, play, we'll do a playthrough as well as uh, Kendo, Robert Kendo, uh, how his voice sounds here. Uh, personally, to me, it sounds a lot better. So why don't we dive in and play some Resident Evil 2 preview. Hey, Razni. Hey, Ramsey. Hello. Welcome to the stream. And look at that text. Yeah, there were no CG cutscenes in the demo, so how they wanted to get you into the mood was through a typewriter. A brief recap, if you remember the original Resident Evil, it took place in the mansion with the stars team. So now we're going to be introduced to a new set of protagonists, Leon and Claire, but in this demo you only play Leon. Two months later, the real nightmare begins. So basically, it starts like the original Resident Evil 2. Yeah, we avoid those zombies. We don't have bullets. And if we go to the, we go to the character selects. Uh, I mean, the item select screen. There's Leon's avatar. It looks completely different from the one in the final game. It looks younger. But mostly. The, the setup is the same. Hey. Freeze. There's Kendo. Higher pitch. Who are you? What are you doing here? Hold your fire. I'm a human. And look at Leon's face model. It's also different. <sighs> Sorry about that. I thought you were one of them. Oh, What's Gino. Going on in this Gino, uh, Brad isn't here. There's no Brad in the demo. <laughs> I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. Yeah, and Kendo's voice is a better pitch. They lowered the pitch in the final version. I don't know why, but anyway. But you should be safe inside here. I'm keeping a close eye on things. Basically, it doesn't sound like a grumpy man. So we have a first aid spray in the gun shop and there are two caches of bullets that you can pick up okay and then when you go here there's a typewriter but it says it's an old typewriter if i had an ink ribbon i could save my progress save is not available in this preview but it works out the same but he doesn't fire a shotgun 
Oh, we're gonna play the full game in a bit. I just wanted to try this out, guys. This is my opportunity to remember Paul Haddad and uh, play play the different versions of Resident Evil 2 that I came across back in the day. And look at the differences here. There, the gate will not open and you have a direct cut to the police station through a dumpster. There was not there was no truck blocking it. So I just wanted to show the differences. If you never played the demo. There's the bus. Only three zombies. So it's a quick trip to the police station as compared to the full game. And you notice it's a very different uh, BGM. And there, since there's no Brad, the two zombies are here. But we're not going there. Yeah, this is normally where you'd see Brad, but that's only in the final game. And you can interact with the main police station gate. Oh no, yeah, I guess you have to kill the zombies here first. Alright, so since we have enough, we'll kill them. First two zombies to kill. Nice. Well, this is a treat for you, Gino. There, see? First time you'll see the main RPT gate. After you kill those two zombies, you can interact with it. And we're gonna cap some zombie heads. Nice, June. Yeah, it's a headshot, but I didn't get a headshot in the gate. So here we are, the RPD as we'd normally see in the final game. There's no Marvin in the demo. And the first item you pick up here is not bullets, but there is a shotgun. Oh, well, there are bullets here. The shotgun is in Marvin's uh, the office, where Welcome Leon is. And if you try to interact with the computer, all you'll get is this message. It will not operate in this preview. Ah, uh, wait, let's take a look at Leon's model up close. Different face model. Small changes. They made some small changes in the final version. So okay, let's kill some more zombies. Oh wow. There's the second shotgun. Bullets. Oh wow. One more zombie. Let's headshot this guy. how different the precinct key is. It's normal as compared to the diamond, the spade, the heart, and the clover. Of course, when you try to enter through this door, you can't. That's the same. Hey, Michael. No problem. But thank you for dropping in. 
Thanks for dropping in, Michael. I just wanted to show off the Resident Evil 2 demo. For those who have never played it. So it's just a one-time use key. No item box. Of course it's locked. We don't have a small key. And there's the liquor. No bullets. And once you meet the liquor, it's just a drop. That's all. Oops, out of bullets. Nice. Hey Anthony, yeah, I'm doing RE2, technically, but I might do the full game in a bit. Let's see. Of course, you can use the lighter like you do in the final game, and you will get the first gem. Yes, we will. Let's go. I might be playing Leon B again later, so hang on to that, guys. So right now, if you're just joining us in the stream, I'm playing the Resident Evil 2 preview that was included with the Resident Evil Director's Cut release in 1997. Wow. She lunged. Dark room is mostly the same. Oh, here you just get nothing. So this is the only place in the demo that's accessible that has the item box. Now, if you had a game shark, you could visit other areas that were not supposed to be explored in the demo. And I've done that back in the day. But since we don't have access to that right now, we can't. I can develop film here. That's it. Okay. You'll also notice the BGM is different here. Uh, we're gonna miss Paul Haddad. He really brought Leon to life and everybody else who followed him in the role of Leon, I'd always remember him as the that tone, that pitch that came from Paul. I hope he's in a better place. Rest in peace, my friend. Hey, Michael. Hey, Fox Die Gaming. Hey, I'm glad you did a tribute stream as well. Right now, I'm playing the demo version of Resident Evil 2 that was included with the Resident Evil Director's Cut. Just to give fans who've never played this demo 
a look at it. So there were a couple of differences. After this, we'll be playing the full game. Alright, another zombie. Oh, we can waste bullets. Nice. We got one more. Cannot open that. And this is our final destination in the demo, the star's office. So it's as plain as you can see. Same picture of the star's members. Captain Wesker's desk. Uh, yeah. Barry's desk. Chris and Jill's desk, and of course, Chris's diary. Nothing there, we can't touch that. Of course, there's a first aid spray here. And to end the demo, you touch this control panel to get the key, and this happens. Yes, this is where they initially wanted to introduce Ada. Then that's the end of the demo. The nightmare has only just begun. What will happen to Leon and Claire? Now take note, we didn't have internet that much back in the day, so we didn't, we didn't think that was Claire or Ada. You know, we were guessing who that mysterious female figure was, but eventually it was Ada. Alright, so I'll be back. I'll be playing more Resident Evil 2. Let me just prepare it. Hold on a sec, guys. While I change configuration. Michael, I'm sorry. I just read your message. Another time, my friend. Okay. Now we got it. Let's play some Leon B. Oh, it's Leon's disc? Alright. Alright, hold on a sec, fellas. I thought I put Leon's disc in. Should be it. Okay. All right, we're done with that. Let's hope this goes. Resident Evil. Let's play more Resident Evil 2 in honor of Mr. Paul Haddad, aka the original Leon. All right, let's go. Leon B, my favorite scenario. 
In the midst of the T-virus outbreak in Raccoon City, Claire Redfield succeeded in escaping from the city, along with one of the only other survivors, a young girl named Sherry. However, however, behind their escape was the lone survivor of the Raccoon City Police Department. Leon S. Kennedy. Leon S. Kennedy. Of course, I wanted to play this version because it has Mr. X. Streaming some Resident Evil 2 tonight in memory of Mr. Paul Haddad. May he rest in peace. I will always remember him for his portrayal here. Of Leon S. Kennedy. What have we got here? What have we got here? Marks. <laughs> Paul, you're pretty good. Wait, don't shoot. Nice headshot. We can't stay out here. Head to the police station. It'll be a lot safer. Same character model as Leon. Boom. You okay? Still in one piece. <laughs> yes. In honor of him, Angelo. In honor of him. I'm doing this for Paul. to finish the game anew at the same time at the same place you have to survive this nightmare to know the true end
And we're back inside the police station from the other side. Yes, you will take the cabin key. Classic RE2, never gets old. Take out the items inside the safety deposit box. And the map. that fire. Oh, 
many times have we put out this fire? Let's do this. That game of Resident Evil 3 Remake is so easy. Ah, I can't blame you. It was. As compared to the original Resident Evil 3, yeah. Thanks for tuning into the stream. Okay, let's get the stuff in the helicopter. Shotgun shells with no shotgun to use. And Mr. X arrives. face him down people we're gonna face him down I want that extra ammo Got him. Save ammo, get more ammo. And now we have two liquors to deal with. <laughs> no, no, no. Angelo, I'm not gonna rocket launcher this guy I'm playing a normal playthrough so we're gonna have a couple more dealings with Mr. X later on but not as bad as the remake run 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 all right 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 come on you ouch Yeah, we have more shotgun shells, but we need a shotgun. Thank <laughs> you. 
First save room. solutions against Mr. X but we're not gonna do that not in this playthrough Yes, we'll go down the ladder. There's the shotgun. We'll need that for Brad. We'll just unlock the doors first. I think in the remake, those are three medallions. The simpler times. Let's take a visit at Brad. Headshot. More shotgun shells. Thank <laughs> you. 
State spring. isn't here. There it is. Use the lighter. save room. for joining me in the stream tonight those who are here or rather this morning wherever you are in the world hope you're safe this is in memory of Paul Haddad the original voice actor of Leon S. Kennedy in the original Resident Evil 2 which I'm playing right now passed away on April 11th may he rest in peace and we'll always remember him Solve another jewel puzzle. We'll leave 
it to the Resident Evil janitor to clean up those mess. Chris's diary. Let's get the film. Search the desk 50 times for a special item. Well, rather, an Easter egg. Someone must have searched the desk. Come on, 50 times. Stars. Thanks for the Magnum. Mohammed. Hey, wait. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, I found Rebecca. Or rather a film of her. And now we see Shewi. Who drops a key. Thanks, Shewi. Clear. You made it. Yeah. Have you seen a little girl around here? Yeah, you just missed her. Who is she? I don't know. But it's too dangerous for her to stay here alone. Leon, I'll go look for her. You go and find us a way out of here. Of course. But before I forget, here's a radio. That way we can keep in touch if something comes up. We're gonna miss you, Paul. Awesome, Leon. I'll go look for her. You go and find us a way out of here. And this is the moment when the zombies enter. Drop off some items first. Continue.
about it. Okay, question from the audience. Mohammed says, what do I think of the Resident Evil 2 remake? I love it. I mean, it doesn't have the zapping system from this, but I think it's the best among the remakes, personally. I mean, visually, the original Resident Evil remake was great, but in terms of action, I love the Resident Evil 2 remake among the three remakes. Last year's Resident Evil 2 remake was a good love letter to this. And the RE engine brought it to life spectacularly. Let's keep on going. So a question to you guys. What's your favorite moment from this where Paul Haddad voiced Leon S. Kennedy? What do you remember? What made you think of him as the Leon that you remember in the original Resident Evil 2? Oops. Keep on going. Oh, great. I missed. Another one. Nice. We're going. I can bite, go. <laughs> Anthony, controls were so trippy. Oh, you bet. Tank controls. It's old school Resident Evil 2. Is Leon's voice actor different from Resident Evil 4? Yes, Mohammed. In Resident Evil 4, Leon was voiced by Paul Mercier, but they sounded the same, which is why I say that uh, Paul Haddad set the tone and style of Leon's voice. He was the OG Leon. Yeah, all right, let's get out of here. We're not gonna bother that liquor.
You're gonna face more zombies! More shotgun shells. And another roll of film. Small key. So we took care of the zombies there. Time to get the custom handgun parts. To we'll develop the film, then we we'll go up. Yeah, I put the walkthrough in my head. <laughs> Fit, then we'll go to the original. Yeah, so prefer the uniform. Dun, 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 
Dun dun dun. stream RE games other than RE2? Yeah, Mohammed, I streamed a couple of old school Resident Evil games. Director Scott, Resident Evil 3 Nemesis, this one, and all the remakes. So, so far those are the ones that I've done. You can check my past videos. But I plan to stream other stuff. We'll see. Right now, we're doing this in memory of Paul Haddad, so it's back to classic RE2. I also know that Paul's, one of Paul's last works was Daymare 1998 and that's out in Steam. Uh, it's also going to be out for the PlayStation 4 on April 28th so if you guys want to check that out, please do.
another puzzle. to the kennel yet. Oh, there's the other film. Ben. Let me guess. You must be Ben, right? Get up now. What do you want? I'm trying to sleep here. Is this the guy? Ben, you told the city officials that you knew something about what's been going on, didn't you? What did you tell them? Who the heck are and you? who the heck are you? I'm trying to find my boyfriend. His name's John. He was working for a branch office of Umbrella, based in Chicago, but he suddenly disappeared six months ago. I heard a rumor that he's here in the city. I don't know anything. And even if I did, why would I want to tell you? Okay, I say we leave him in there. Does anyone know where they put the key to this cell? <laughs> I have it right here, officer. But I'm not about to leave this cell. Those zombies aren't the only things crawling around out there. Isn't it strange Ben sounds like Carlos in the remake? <laughs> what was that? Like I said, I'm not leaving this cell. They have that accent. Get out of here before you lead it right to me. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. I'm the only cop left alive in this building. What? Look, if you want to live, then you're going to have to leave with me. But oh, Leon. do you even know how to get out of the city? There's a kennel in the back of the building. 
Inside the kennel is a manhole. Go through and it'll lead you to the sewer entrance, but it won't be easy. All right, I'm going. There goes Ada again. doggy. Time to control Ada. Ada? I don't think I've introduced myself yet. My name's Leon. I'm with the RPD. It's a dead end. You think we can get upstairs through this shaft? Give me a boost. I'll go and check. That little girl must have dropped this. I think I'll hold on to it for her.
go up. Thanks for the key. Back to Leon. Leon, can you hear me? Ada, did you find anything? Oops, hold on. Right here. Think fast. Think fast. Here's one more. Hey, I can't reach the ventilation hole. I'm going to have to find another way around. I'll catch up with you later. What? Ada, wait! Can now enter Chief Iron's office. Doggies. That reloading time almost got me. <laughs> Ooh. 
smack the bullets. Side pack, of course. Thank you for joining me for the stream tonight in memory of Paul Haddad, the original voice actor of Leon S. Kennedy. May he rest in peace, and we'll always remember him for this role. More shotgun bullets. Get the crank so we can go ahead. is in Chief Iron's office. We'll get it later. this hey Josh welcome to the stream and I'll read out your message in a bit hold on rest in peace Paul this is the most scary game I ever played as a kid quickly became one of my all-time favorites I almost would have named my son Leon but I had a daughter <laughs> well, duh. that is my favorite video game character in any game besides Sam from Yes, love Norman and Hideo as well. Death Stranding, guys. But rest in peace, Paul. Quick time legend for this performance. Thank you, Josh, for that tri uh, loving tribute message. Yeah, I agree. We're all gonna miss Paul. And I also love Death Stranding. Thank you for tuning in, man. And we have to prepare for this because once you move, a surprise. Thanks, Mr. X. Give me some bullets. Where's the wheel? No sound, as you notice, because we're going to have another encounter.
that'll do. More bullets. Man, what a mess. Mohammed, you didn't hear the news? Um, well, there are multiple reports online. I even blogged about it in my page. You can check it out there. Uh, well, still tough to talk about. Uh, Paul passed away at 56, and he was battling throat cancer and a neurological disorder. But it was it was just reported he passed away on April 11th. So. It was really tough for the Resident Evil community. That's why I'm doing this stream in honor of him and his role as Leon S. Kennedy. Still sad. A lot of people are sad about it. Angeles Evans. The first time I played Resident Evil 2, I was. Yeah, man. Welcome to the stream. I'm glad. We're all fans. Chief's Diary. Thank you for sharing, also. Thank you very much. Keep on going. We're gonna finish this game for Paul. Oh, there's the diary. Better get ready. We know what's coming. up for, for everything you ate. At least Mr. X in the original gave you rewards. If you fight him in the remake, it's just to stall him. You don't get anything. Thank you. 
A tyrant photo. Press that. There's no crank yet. Or gear. Gear, rather. There we go. Now we press it. Time to see Ben again. better death than the one he got in A and in the remake. Leon. Where are you going, Ada? To the chemical plant. I have a feeling that's where I'll find John. Ada, wait! Are you crazy? The streets are still crawling with zombies. It'll be alright, trust me. We found a way to the sewer. Follow us later. Claire! Claire! Wait, wait! Man, why doesn't anyone ever listen to me? <laughs> Those quips. Time to fight Birkin!
Falcon, aka G. Sewers. Ada. What was that all about? Running off like that was reckless and stupid. Those zombies are everywhere. Not to mention that thing that got banned. I was there, Leon. I know. Look, Ada. As an officer, it's my job to look out for you. But we're not going to get through this alive if we don't work together, okay? All right. We'll do this your way, for now. Yeah, spend more bullets because of the animation doesn't clear that he is dead ah William Birkin yeah you just have to get the pattern Mohammed and uh, the best weapon to use is the Magnum it just takes six bullets again
Okay, cutscene time. Don't worry. You're the one who's with that cop, if I'm not mistaken. Identify yourself. Ada? Ada? Ada Wong. Ada Wong. I've heard that name before. Now I remember. One of the men from Chicago who came to assist the T-Virus research used his girlfriend's name as his password. Ada and John. How did you know? Who are you? Annette Birkin. My husband is the man responsible for the creation of the T-Virus. William Birkin. What? John's dead. He became one of those zombies. My condolences. And although I regret this, you will be joining him shortly. I won't let anyone take the G-Virus away from me. G-Virus? It's capable of creating the ultimate bioweapon. Its potential is even greater than that of the T-Virus. Then that must mean the creature in the police department is... Precisely. Precisely. My husband, William. And it's all Umbrella's fault. None of this would have happened if they hadn't tried to steal his research away from him. Where did you get that? looks exactly like the one I gave Sherry. She dropped it. I've been holding on to it for her. Liar! Give it back to me! <laughs> Too bad. Back to Leon. No alligator, we killed it with Claire. So it's just gonna be a straight rescue Ada mission. Ada? First, we can visit the side of Claire. Wait, we'll have to come back. We have to get the small key. and the small key. Spiders. Now this this is optional but you get more ammo so why not? Thank <laughs> you. 
done with the game. Whoopee. Halfway there. You can see no alligator, it's dead. So we just reunite with Ada. Ada! Ada! Leon, this bullet wound isn't making things any easier. Quiet, Leon. I'll patch you up. That's two I owe you. Don't mention it. I just found out. John's dead. What? Never mind. Let's just get out of here. The sooner the better. Here we 
go. to the lab for the last. said nice hey Carlo welcome to the stream buddy that's Loki guys he's my friend oh my god yeah let's go Thank you for watching the stream. Thank you for watching the stream, dude. This is for Paul Haddad, the original voice actor of Leon Kennedy. He passed away a couple of days ago. So we're doing this in his memory. Hope you're okay, Carlo. We're gonna see each other soon along with our other friends. Take care, man. finally arrived 
There must be something hidden here. Let's go. This is one of my favorite parts of the game. Okay. Boom. Shotgun. Okay. Oh yeah. Please visit Carlos Page Joe Star Scream. That's his alias. He is in Facebook. You'll see a lot of stuff there. Joe Starscream. As in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure and Transformers. Shout out. coming then mr. X For another boss fight. So guys, thanks again for watching this stream. We're doing this in the memory of Paul Haddad, the voice actor of Leon S. Kennedy, who passed away on April 11th. May he rest in peace and we'll always remember him for playing Leon. So I am playing Leon B right now and we're almost at the end of the game.
we're gonna have some romance time. Welcome back. Uh. Hey, take it easy. We're inside Umbrella's secret lab. I'll go find something to treat that wound, so just rest here in the meantime. But I'll only slow you down with these injuries. Go. Save yourself. Is it just me, or does everybody always ignore what I say? Pretty much. I told you, it's my job to look after you. But you'll be in danger if you stay with me. I know I've only known you for a short period of time, but I really enjoy being with you. I... I know I'm not capable of caring about anyone, but I don't want to lose you. We're leaving this place together. Wait here for me. I'll be right back. Uh, yeah, um, Mohammed, the kissing part is this one. This is scenario B. You're gonna see that later. You're gonna see that later, buddy. You're gonna see that later. <laughs> the best scene. One of my favorites, and Paul delivered that well. Including the agonizing Ada scream. liquors
god, wrong way. Check for cutscene. Ada? Where did she go? Shotgun ammo.
them parts. Oh. <sighs> 
always use that. Time for that scene. I know what you're looking for. You came for the gene virus, didn't you? Take it from me. This is my husband's legacy. Now, where's that spy you were working with earlier? You know who I'm talking about. What? You really don't know anything, do you? <laughs> you're so gullible. She's one of the operatives sent here by the agents. The reason why she came here is to obtain the G-Virus. That's a lie. No, it's the truth. I discovered this girl had a background check on her. She specifically got close to John and became his girlfriend to get information about her brother. That can't be. I know her. Ada wouldn't do something like that. If you don't want to believe it, I don't believe it. You're about to die anyway. Oh, Mr. X. As usual, it takes four shots. Hey, more Magnum bullets. Best scenes Paul has ever done as Leon. Kiss is the name of the song. Uh, this is Ada. No. Ada! Nice scream. Self-destruct sequence has been activated. Repeat. 
the self-destruct sequence has been activated, this sequence may not be aborted. All employees proceed to the emergency car at the bottom platform. I will always remember you. Goodbye, Ada. Likewise to you, Paul. We'll always remember you for this road. Master Chief. Rodrigo, I couldn't fill your dark soul with light. <laughs> I just read that. Next one, dude. Well, at least he got the same sherry.
It's Mr. X Tyrant time. Almost done. work. 
you done. What was that? Warning, biohazardous outbreak imminent. The emergency system has been activated. This train will detonate. Repeat, this train will detonate. What's wrong? I don't know. The door won't open. for the road. Thanks, man.
Bye, William. So, it's finally over. Sherry, you look terrible. No worse than you, Claire. Come on, time to leave. Now? What's wrong? Is something following us? We have to go. We don't have any time to waste. Go? Where? Hey, it's up to us to take out Umbrella. <laughs> Rest in peace, Paul Adad. You are Leon S. Kennedy, and thank you for that role. Well, guys, there it is. Resident Evil 2. I'm just going to see my ranking, and we'll call it a day, a night, wherever you are. Thank you for watching. I'm going to miss Paul. But this is in memory of him, so a lot of people stream Resident Evil 2. I love Leon B. Rodrigo! Umbrella have so many bombs. Yeah, they do. <laughs> Just in case. Yeah, it's up to us to take out Umbrella. Rest in peace, Paul. Oh, by the way, those who played the Resident Evil 3 remake, this song is in the diner. Paul Haddad. done. Rest in peace, Paul Adad. Thank you for bringing to life Leon in this classic game. And let's see our rank. Alright. The highest rank in the US version, A. This is for you, Paul. Rest in peace. Uh, in the Japanese version, the highest rank is S, but in the North American version, it's A. So, no saves, no use of first aid sprays, and no use of infinite weapons. So that's why I got those two rewards. So thank you everybody for joining me. Rest in peace, Paul Haddad. You'll always be Leon Kennedy to us. And keep on playing Resident Evil 2 in your memory. Thank you guys, thank you so much. I will. I really don't need to save it anymore, so... Alright, join me again for more streams, more video game streams. I'll be playing more Resident Evil installments that I haven't played yet and streamed. So, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you. Rest in peace, Paul.